Ebla. According to the Minister of Relief and Disaster Preparedness, Musa Echeru, the entire country is affected by the dry spell, but the following are the adversely affected districts. Kisoro, Kabong, Bukwa, Yumbe, Kasese in areas of Rimi and Mubuku, Yumbe, and Bulambuli among others. The Relief and Disaster Preparedness Ministry says preliminary findings from the Situation Assessment Team countrywide show that the current farming season is gone, with most of the perennial crops and food crops such as beans, cassava, cowpeas and maize are drying up in the gardens. In the Elgon region, the low-lying areas, people had opened fields and fields of uh, maize. As we talk, you can light it until it catch fire now. Again, as this backdrop, a chair warns the country could face a food shortage in the following months. I want to assure the country that we will not allow a situation where our people will die of hunger. So far, five people are reported to have died of hunger in a park district in Karamoja as a result of the current dry spells that will extend into next month. We have already started emergency relief distribution in the districts, particularly Kabo, which was severely hit and where we, people are, suffered displacement into neighboring Kenya. Uh, we have started distribution there and we are likely to roll it even to other districts within Karamoja that find themselves in that kind of situation. Some areas, like Kasese, were also affected by the floods when River Nyamamba burst its banks. It killed eight people and washed away gardens. A month later, the sun has caught what was left behind. Echoro says that as government continues to study the situation, weather forecasts show that most areas in the country will receive rains in July. For now, the Relief and Disaster Ministry is working together with the Ministry of Agriculture and that of Water and Sanitation to ensure the farmers are given the seeds as well as alerted in time to take advantage of the new planting season. Recently, we voted for resources for the Ministry of Agriculture. Uh, this year, uh, the percentage is a lot higher than what they have been receiving and we are in touch with them to make sure that they remain on the ready to intervene in this direction. Echeru says the Ministry of Agriculture will identify certified suppliers of reliable seeds that will be distributed across the country to the affected communities that reported crop failure. Fact is that most of the seeds that we give, that most of the, the beans that we give are not certified. They are not meant for planting. They are meant for eating. They are meant as a relief. Now, so, so when we give relief, out of despair, because they have no options, they have ended up planting some of it. Efforts to get a comment from the Ministry of Agriculture were futile. Drought and dry spells were last recorded in the country in 2005, in 2007, and also 2011. With the next yield expected between November and December, there is looming concern over food shortages and the government's long-term plan to ensure food security in the country. Sudil Biarhanga, NTV, Kampala. Okay.